Fist arthroscopy is a commonly performed procedure for the investigation of wrist joint disorders, so it's commonly a diagnostic test. This is because clinical examination of the wrist is difficult as it consists of a multitude of joints and so it's different from many other of the joints that we treat in orthopaedic surgery. In addition, because of its size and the size of these joints, even with recent advances in MRI scanning and even MRI arthrography, arthrography it can be difficult to visualise all of the joint surfaces. Therefore, diagnostic arthroscopy is what we call the gold standard, i.e. it is the best way to find out what's going inside some wrist joints. In terms of the procedure, it's a very simple procedure that can be undertaken under local just trying to find the diagnosis, or general anaesthetic from some form of regional block. It involves insertion of a small telescope or arthroscope into the joint cavity. The telescopes we use these days are very small, being less than two millimetres in diameter. Obviously, one looks round the whole of what's called the radiocarpal joint and the midcarpal joint, which are the two parts of the wrist joint, and also if necessary, what's called the distal radiocarpal joint to assess the nature of the joint, to see the nature of any damage to the joint, such as arthritis or damage to the ligaments. And of course, the most important about wrist arthroscopy is one can stress the joint so one gets a dynamic impression of what's going on inside the joint. As I say, it is the gold standard for the assessment of wrist joint disorders, which are not seen on other forms of imaging. In addition to diagnostic arthroscopy of the wrist, there are occasions when Operations may be performed through the telescope to resolve wrist problems, and this is known as a therapeutic wrist arthroscopy. There are a variety of conditions that can be treated in the wrist. The commonest would be resection or repair of what's called the TFCC, which is rather like the cartilage of the knee, and which can be damaged in the same way. If there is a torn portion, then this can be removed via the telescope. And on occasions, if the tear is at the edge of the TFCC, it can be repaired through the telescope. Other, other operations, such as what's called debridement, i.e. getting rid of arthritic problems with inside the wrist, is commonly performed through the telescope. And some forms of wrist ligament problems can be treated by means of what's called capture shrinkage, which essentially means heating up the ligaments of the wrist in a controlled fashion so that they become tighter. So as well as diagnostic arthroscopy, it is certainly possible to treat risks via the telescope. Thank you.